Oh, this is how many times people have been laid. Nice. Uh, I've been laid once. Who, who, did somebody sleep with me while I was gone? Comrade here, back in this more Legend of the Red Dragon, or Lord, as I like to call it. I think I've had my butt handed to me since I've been gone. Look at everybody is like level 6 and 5 and whatnot. There's Agrisantos, remember we fought him last time and now he's level 4. Where am I at? I think I checked before, I'm in like 48th place. There I am, down near the bottom. I'm alive, and nobody killed me. Well, that's cool. Uh, enter the realm. For being a death knight, you get an extra death knight use point. You are in low spirits today. You wake up early, sheath your weapon, and head down to the bar. Yeah, hey, uh, that's where we're at. Okay, what happened while we were gone? Lucian killed somebody. Willow killed people. Jasmine killed people. Kelsey's boyfriend killed people. Knew that was going to happen. Man, there's a lot of action happening. Cool, but I don't see my name mentioned anywhere. So everybody left me alone. Alright, well that's cool. Uh, let's flirt with Violet right off the bat. So we winked at her last time, so this time we're going to be bold. We're going to kiss her hand. Take Violet's hand and you kiss it. She pulls her ha ha hand away. Pulls her hair away. Pulls her hand away and laughs merrily. Your relationship with her is taken off and you get 20 XP because of it. Talk to the bartender. Nope, we're good. Okay, back to the bar and then back to the town square. Uh, what we got in the bank? I don't remember. We got a grand in the bank. Okay, that's cool. Uh, we need three to upgrade our weapons and armor. Weapons or armor. Uh, what about the training? Uh, Turgeon's training area, question our master, we need 120 to fight him. Keep an eye on that, and we'll go to the forest. Oh, right off the bat, we get a weird event. Uh, you're heading into the forest when you hear the voice of angels singing. Look at that mouse cursor on the screen again. It's a death of me. Okay. Uh, you follow the sound for some time when you're about to give up. You find two gems. Sweet. Let's immediately go back to the inn and uh, talk to the bartender and trade these gems in. I buy one elixir and I'm all about that defense. Cool. Nice. Good way to start the day with some elixir. Look for something to kill. Uh, what did we find? Frederick the Limpin' Baboon. We know he's no problem. He misses me completely. I hit him for 16 and he's done. Uh, okay. Look for something to kill. Found the rude boy. He's no threat. Look for something to kill. Got a wild man. No threat. Look for something to kill. Another wild man. They're teaming up on me. He misses me completely. And then he died. Look for something to kill. Oh, look at that. I can go get me some loot now. That's awesome. Okay, return. Uh, go to the bank. Let's withdraw it all, even though we're not going to need all that, but still. Uh, not that button, that button. So, let's look at our stats. That's V, right? Yeah, V. View your stats. So, I got a dagger and a heavy coat, so I'm even odds. I, I think I'm going to go with the armor first this time. So, sell my armor. Sell my heavy coat. Girl takes your armor and gives you the money. Buy. What do we get? A leather vest. Looking sharp, too. Yep, I want it. Sweet. Girl takes your money and helps you into your new armor. Go back to the bank. Deposit everything we got. Is anybody online? Uh, people online. No, it's just me tonight. Alright. Alright, back to the forest. Look for something to kill. A huge bald man. Misses me completely. I got him for 17 and he's dead too. Uh, let's quickly go back and to the training area, question my master, 79 I need. Alright, getting closer. Uh, forest, look for something to kill, rude boy, no threat, 
Look for something to kill. Membrane man. I have no idea what that means. What what would a membrane man mean? B. Anyways, he's dead. Found a gem. I think I got two gems. Yup. Yeah. Back into the inn. And we're going to talk to the bartender. We're going to trade in our gems for an elixir. And we're going to put it towards vitality. I got a little bit of a theme going here. I'm going to get my vitality up. What's my attack strength? It's 20. My defense strength is 17. Cool. Back to the forest. Uh, look for something to kill. Evil wood nymph. Done. Look for something to kill. Frederick the Limpin' Baboon. He surprises me, but he misses me completely. And then he misses me completely again. It's that, it's that gems and the vitality. It's, it's working out. 97 gold. Look for something to kill. Rude boy. Need something a little bit more of a threat here. A bent river dryad. Okay, it's not him. Look for something to kill. Extra special event. Your journey is interrupted by the sound of many tiny voices squealing in delight. It seems you've come across a group of fairies bathing. Hot. Uh, you are noticed. The small things encircle you. A small wet female bangs your shin. How dare you spy on us, human? You can't help but smile. Defiance, the defiance in her silvery voice is truly a sight. You think to yourself, further... Oh, you think to yourself. Further contemplation is interrupted by another sharply painful prod. Ask for a blessing or try to catch, ones, catch one and show your friends. Hmm... Um, A is defaulted. See, I'm trying to remember, and meaning I'm trying to remember back to when bulletin board systems were a thing and the internet hadn't been invented yet, so it's a far stretch for my memory to go. But I think if you catch one, something amazing happens. But I don't remember what it is, so I'm going to just ask for the blessing. Try it, try it another day. Let's see what happens with this. Uh, bless me, you implore the small figure. Very well, she agrees, but we're still angry with you. The blessing is a companion for your travels. A pure white mare nudges your back. You feel the day grow longer. What just happened? I got a horse? I did. Take the horse to the Dark Cloak Tavern. Hmm. Let's do it. What happens? You nudge your horse deeper into the woods. In the gloom of the shady forest, you see smoke coming from a bright chimney. Right. Nice. We've been here before, but uh, I'll read it again. A blazing fire warms your heart as well as your body in this fragrant round roadhouse. Many a wary traveler has had the good fortune to find this cozy hostel, to escape the harsh reality of the dense forest for a few moments. You notice someone has etched something into the table you are sitting at. Uh, where is the examine etchings in the table? Oh, this is how many times people have been laid. Nice. Player kills. Uh, I've been laid once? Who, who, did somebody sleep with me while I was gone? I don't remember that. I don't remember getting laid. Okay. Uh, what else can we do here? Converse with patrons. What are we saying? Uh... Ba, ba, ba. And so it begins, there is a unit calling himself my boyfriend. Uh, bees nice. F frowny face. Um, what else can we do in here? Talk with the bartender. Uh, change profession. Learn about your enemies. Talk about colors. Practice. Co okay, nothing I want to do there. Is there nothing I want to do in this whole situation? I know you can gamble, but I don't, I don't, uh, I don't like gambling in real life. <laughs> so I don't often do it in games. Um, but yeah, like, do I have this horse forever now? I can just go there whenever I want. That's pretty sweet. Look for something to kill. Membrane man came back. He wants to be killed again. Look for something to kill. And here he is again. Learn his lesson. Look for something to kill. Bent River Dryad. He's done. Oh, now he's done. Okay. Uh, nobody is hitting me with anything, though. This whole gem strategy is, is working out. Uh, return to the town square and go to Turgeon's and question him. 
I need five more experience. Uh, how many forest fights do I have left? I have 14 left, so we're doing good there. Uh, Frederick Limp and Baboon, he's dead and he gave me six. So we're good to go. Uh, let's go back to the town square. Let's go back to the bank. Let's deposit all of our money. And let's go see if we can take down Barack. Baraka? Just Barack. Okay. Question my master. He's like, you know you are actually getting pretty good with that thing. And you know he's not talking about my sword. Um, okay, so attack. Whew, whew, here we go. All right. You enter the fighting arena, ready with your dagger. I wish I had more than a dagger. I thought I did have more of a dagger. No, maybe that was the last game. All right. Uh, when your name is called, you move to the proper position and take a fighting stance against your master. Master fight. You have encountered Brack. Your skill allows you to get the first strike. He's got 40 hit points. I only got 30. Let's see. I hit him for 19. He misses me completely because I'm so full of gem elixirs. Hit him again. 17. He's done. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. You have bested Brack. Children of Mara. Mara? Something like that. You have bested me. They have weird curse words in the, in the fantasy world of Lord of the Red Dragon. Legend of the Red Dragon. Uh, you have received 15 hit points, 7 strength, and 3 defense points. You're now level 3. Your class skill is raised by 1. And you need... Two more lessons to raise your Death Knight uses per day. Got it. Next master is Aragorn. Nice. Okay. Uh, what we got in the bank here? Two grand. We need about 400 more bucks and then we can upgrade that dagger. So let's go back to the forest. And let's look for something to kill. Rude boy. I'm still fighting rude boys at level three. Uh, Headbanger of the West. Nice. He misses me completely. Took him out. Okay, uh, still need a little bit more money, so let's look for something to kill. Morbid Walker. He's done. That's enough money. Okay, back to the bank. Withdraw all my doings. And then let's head to King Arthur's weapon shop. Let's sell me a dagger. Right, and let's buy the short sword. Moving on up in the world. Yeah, I won't buy it. Damn right, it's great. Uh, deposit all that extra gold. Return. And back to the forest. Where we will look for something to kill. Oh, look, I got two gems. Before we do that, let's head over to the tavern. That's not the tavern. The inn. And let's talk to the bartender. Let's talk to him about gems. And let's trade in the gems for an elixir. Let's put it in the vitality because that's working for me. And back to the forest we go. Uh, ten more fights to go. Let's look for something to kill. A muscled midget. That's not PC anymore. Muscled little person. Uh, we took him out in one shot. Feel good about that. Rude boy. Can't get enough. Morbid walker again. He's done. Extra special event. Your journey is interrupted by the sound of many tiny voices. They can't give me a second horse, right? It seems you've come across a group of fairies bathing. How dare you spy on us? Ask for a blessing or try to catch one. Well, like, I don't know. They can't give me another horse. Maybe they'll give me something else just as sweet, though. So let's try. Ask. Your blessing is a forest melody. Immediately, a small figure in the back raises her tiny reed flute to her lips and begins to play. The strange sounds send thousands of images to your mind. You learn fairy lore and get 90 experience. Well, that's pretty good, right? Like, what, what am I at? Uh, well, yeah, that's it's, it's pretty good. Like, oh, I'm looking at my gold. Where's my experience? Oh, 90 experience. That is pretty good. I was only at 500 then. It even says there I'm on horseback now, too. Sweet. These fairies are working out for me, too. Look for... I didn't mean to check my mail. Nobody's writing anything to me. Look for something to kill. I encountered a redneck. I killed a redneck. All right. Look for something to kill. A black owl. He surprises me, but he misses completely. He misses me completely again, but I hit him for 19. And I took him out. I'm raking in the money all of a sudden, too. Like, how much more money do I need to buy the next level of armor? 10 grand for some bronze armor. 
got it. Okay, back to the forest. I got five more fights to go. Another black owl. He's done. Uh, fortune smiles on you. You find a gem. I need one more to do anything with it. Killed another rude boy. So many rude boys. Muscled midget. He's done. Two more fights. Uh, black owl, actually. He's the first one to hit me so far with anything. And only four damage. No, oh, and nine damage, actually. But he's dead. And let's do our last fight here. Let's look for something to kill. I find a black owl, and since it's my last fight, I'm going to use my death knight attack. Because I haven't got to use it yet. Ultra powerful move. In a swift move, you, ha you have black owl by the neck. I don't believe owls have necks. And begin to exert huge amounts of pressure. You hear a sickening crack. You hit black owl for 72 damage. A well-placed blow knocks the winged creature to the ground. That's cool how they, like, they, they, it's specific to the winged creature and all that. You kill the black owl, you receive 711 gold and 26 experience. And that's it for the forest fights for today, because I'm too tired. I'll try again tomorrow. All right, back, and let's go to the healer's hut and, like, oh, wait, wait. Before we do that, we'll go to the inn, and we'll hear Seth sing, and he may heal me. Okay, ask him to sing. Uh, the gods have power. The gods are just. The gods help his people when they must. Gods can heal the sick. Even the cancer. Pray to the gods that your will will be answered. You find yourself wishing for more money. This is the same one I got last time. So if I go to the bank. Do I have... Whoa, ho, 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 ho. I got all kinds of money here. All right. But I don't have... I don't think so anyways. Right? No, I'm shy of getting the next level of armor. But that's still cool. Deposit all that, please. All right. Uh, what else can we do? What else can we do? How far away am I from here? Oh, what is he saying? Questioning your master. You are now level three, and you are actually becoming well-known in the realm. I heard your name being mentioned by Violet. Ye God, she's hot. Aragorn looks at you carefully. You need 252 experience. Okay. So, next time. Oh, I didn't mean to question. I meant to return. Anybody online yet? No. Okay, let's see who's in the field. Let's see who didn't get a chance to uh, sleep in the inn. What's in the dirt? Anything? Yeah, okay. Eunuch is the most dangerous with 13 kills. I wonder how many I got. Does it say? Um, no, I don't see it saying that anywhere. No. Okay. Uh, slaughter. And who's in the field? Okay. What level am I? I'm level three. And what's my experience again? 748. Ooh, okay. So... The bottom two are the only ones that I'm really going to have a chance at. Obviously, Big Wig, we're going to attack him. Sorry, Big Wig. This probably ain't going to go well for you. Find him brandishing a dagger. Uh, my skills allow me to have the first strike, and I killed him right away. And because I'm Canadian, sorry, but I'm happy. Yes, that looks great. Thank you. Okay. Um, so I got 400 gold and two gems. So we are going to go back to the inn and I'm going to talk to Mr. Bartender about gems. I'm going to get an elixir. I'm going to trade it in for vitality because that works. What's my defense up to? 22. Okay. And I'm also going to go to the bank just in case. I'm going to deposit that 400 gold I got off of them. Still not enough to buy up my new armor but and let's give Rygor a shot here Rygor yes he's got a short sword same as me this is gonna be tight he hits me for three because he surprised me I hit him for 24 he hit me for 13 I think it's all them defense points I've been trading the gems in for let's try again hey I killed him took him out he didn't have any gold on him but he did have a gem and I got uh, the 350 experience once again sorry 
and I'm happy. And yes. Oh, I've stopped by a messenger. Somebody's entered the realm. I can't see the name because it's dark blue on black, but whatever. Um, I think I need to heal up a bit, right? Yeah. Oh, I don't have any money on me, so go to the bank. Uh, withdraw, say a thousand. Just in case he attacks me while I'm in the middle of healing up here. Okay, and back to the bank. Deposit what's left. And slaughter. Oh, slaughter. List who's in the field. Ugh, I can't see that guy's name. Sorry about this. I got to go up to the screen and read that. Leon Knights. I don't know why I yelled. I got the microphone pinned to my chest. Okay. Slaughter. Leon. That's the one. Okay, he's got a short sword too. Let's see how this goes. He's online. Issuing the challenge. You, oh, he hides from me. All right. Uh, I think that's everybody that I'm willing to fight. Yeah, like I'm not... How's this guy get 28,000 experience? The game's only been going for a few days. Anybody married yet or... No, no one's married in the realm. Okay, I don't even remember how you get married. Like you can marry Violet, right? If you go to the inn and you flirt with Violet. Oh, yeah, I can't because I already I don't want to be moving too fast. But I think the final option is to marry her. But uh, I don't know how you marry other people. Is that something you can do? Um, take my horse to that place. Can you marry people in here? Uh, I don't think so. I, I, I don't know how you do it. It's a way to do it. Okay, is that it though? Is that all I can do? List of warriors. Did I move up? Yeah, I moved up a bit. Um, you know, I was down there. Now I'm up there. Moved up like two thirds of the list. That's not bad. Okay, I guess that's about it, right? Um, what am I doing here? Okay. Uh, so I need to go to the bank and I need to withdraw 800 bones and then I need to return to town and then I need to go to the inn and yeah, I guess that's it. Get a room. Oh, that'll be 1200 gold. It used to be 800. Oh, I'm stopped by a messenger that dude has left the realm. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, I guess I need more gold because I leveled up. Is that the way it works? Okay. 1,200 it is then. And then back to the inn. Get a room. Yes. Returning to the mundane world. Thank you.